Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into a crucial and timely topic, the new strategy adopted by the U.S. Federal Reserve towards Iraq. This move signifies a major shift in international financial policies and could have significant implications for both countries. Let's unpack what this means and why it matters. Recently, a quote emerged stating, the U.S. Federal Reserve will not be able to wait forever. There are federal measures that may occur at any moment. This statement is quite significant and holds considerable weight. It indicates that the U.S. is ready to take action and isn't willing to sit idly by as economic conditions evolve. Essentially, we're at a point where push is coming to shove and the U.S. is poised to intervene in a substantial way. The reference to federal measures suggests that the U.S. is prepared to implement new policies or sanctions if necessary. This isn't a mere diplomatic warning, it's a clear indication of impending action. For Iraq, this could mean a range of possible scenarios, from economic sanctions to changes in trade policies or even adjustments in how financial transactions are monitored and regulated. The mention of the Central Bank of Iraq CBI, and the U.S. Treasury underscores the interconnectedness of global finance. The CBI plays a pivotal role in maintaining Iraq's economic stability and any pressure from the U.S. Treasury can have a profound impact. The CBI must navigate these pressures while ensuring the Iraqi dinar remains stable and the country's economy continues to grow. This brings us to the core of the issue. Why is the U.S. taking this stance now? The U.S. Federal Reserve and Treasury are likely concerned about several factors, including Iraq's economic policies, its adherence to international financial regulations, and the broader geopolitical landscape. Iraq is strategically significant in the Middle East, and its economic stability is crucial for regional peace and security. Moreover, this situation reflects a broader trend of increasing scrutiny on countries' financial systems. The global economy is more interconnected than ever, and actions in one country can ripple across the world. By signaling potential federal measures, the U.S. is likely aiming to ensure that Iraq aligns more closely with international norms and standards. This isn't just about economic policies, it's also about political influence and ensuring stability in a volatile region. The U.S. has invested heavily in Iraq over the years, both financially and politically. Ensuring that Iraq remains a stable and reliable partner is crucial for U.S. interests in the region. So, what should we expect moving forward? Firstly, we might see increased diplomatic engagement between the U.S. and Iraq. This could involve high-level talks aimed at addressing the concerns that prompted this new strategy. Additionally, there could be economic repercussions if Iraq doesn't align with the expectations set by the U.S. 